A seaside marsh that was damaged due to development has been completely restored two years after human access to the area was banned. This stretch of wetland in Korea's southern coast is now home to endangered species that had not been spotted there before. An expanse of wetland appears near the waters off Kwanimpo. White movements are detected around small holes. They're endangered fiddler crabs characterized by one outsized claw. The number of fiddler crabs more than quadrupled over the past two years. A group of air-breathing snails called Elobium chinense are found toward the drier land among the clumps of zosia grass. This is the first time that the endangered mollusks were discovered inside a national park. Some 350 snails were found inhabiting a small patch of land measuring only about 50 square meters. The endangered convex crab, once believed to have gone extinct, is now spotted again. The mudflat, once badly damaged by throngs of tourists, was designated a special protected zone two years ago. Now the area has regained its former vitality after a two-year ban on human access. The Korea National Park Service plans to transplant some more zosia grass on the restored mudflat and create more sand banks to help expand the habitats of endangered species.